Hello guys, welcome to Cruise Control. Last month Acura officially announced the return of the Integra nameplate in the form of a premium compact model to be launched in 2022. However, it appears that there will also be another Integra compact bearing the Honda badge. As usual, the pictures come from China's Ministry of Industry and Information Technology website, showing every detail of the exterior of the car. You could argue that the 2022 Honda Integra looks ever so slightly sleeker than its Honda Civic sibling from certain angles. The redesigned face incorporates slimmer headlights, a more conventional grille, and smaller intakes. The profile looks identical while at the back there is a pair of L-shaped LED tail lights looking pretty neat and a sporty rear bumper with vertical reflectors and a hidden exhaust pipe. Dual exhaust pipes are optionally available. The new bumpers have made the body slightly longer than the Civic, with the Integra measuring 4,689mm, 184.6 inches long, 1,802mm, 70.9 inches wide, and 1,415mm, 55.7 inches tall. The interior is also derived from the Civic which comes with a 10.2-inch digital instrument panel, a 7 or 9-inch infotainment touchscreen, and the signature horizontal full-width honeycomb design feature on the dashboard that is merging with the climate trends. Equipment includes the Honda Sensing Suite ADIS, adaptive matrix LED headlights, sunroof, and new alloy wheel designed with a diameter of up to 18 inches in diameter. Under the bonnet, there is the same 1.5-liter VTEC turbo 4-cylinder engine producing 180 horsepower, 134 kilowatts, 182 PS, and 240 newton meters, 177 pound-feet, of torque. There are not many information on the specifications but power is most likely sent to the front axle through a CVT gearbox. The Honda Integra will be produced by Guangqi Honda in Guangzhou. What is weird is that the Honda Civic sedan will be also available in China, produced by Dongfeng Honda in Wuhan. Offering two slightly different versions of the same car in China is a common strategy among global automakers due to their collaborations with different local companies. On the other side of the world, the US-bound Integra wearing the Acura badge will likely share its platform with the Civic but it will feature a completely redesigned coupe style body and a more premium character. Whether you agree or disagree with my views, I love to read your comments, thanks for watching, and stay safe everyone.